Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. I know it has been forever since I've done a YouTube video, like... I don't know why I do this, I'm just a massive procrastinator and I think about it all the time. I'm like, maybe I should post a new video and I'm just like, yeah I'll do it tomorrow, 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 two months later, tomorrow, 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 tomorrow. But tomorrow has come today. So this video, right, it is about this black owned clothing brand called Gothic Lamb. Oh my god, seriously, you guys need to check out the stuff that they have on this site. Like, I'm literally done. I'm done. I'm so happy. Like, imagine being part of, you know, a sort of, how do we really call it? Like a culture? Can you call it a culture? I don't know. Call it a cult? Okay, no, let's take that back. Like, imagine being like an alternative person, which is usually sort of related to being white and gothic is white and alternative is white and we've got dolls kill telling us that goth is white like literally it's being a part of you know a genre or a look aesthetic whatever you want to call it that is mainly white people and when you see a brand like gothic lamb just out there and it's appealing to who you are as a person yes that is all i can say that's all i can say is just yes because no one really understands how hard it is to be black and alternative because you've got the black side that is just like oh well this is how you should be this is how you should act this is how you should look as a black person then you've got all the crap that comes with being alternative different to society so imagine putting those two things together and yeah, you are a bit of a social outcast. <laughs> but who cares, because I prefer to be that way. I'd rather be me and not a sheeple. So let's get into showing you some of these clothes. So this one I'm wearing now, I might have to flip it somehow because it looks mirrored, I don't know. It says black metal chick, basically. So it's a crop. I do love crops, like it's January, it's snowing outside, but I do love me a crop top. So that is this one. Let me get on to showing you the others. So this is the next crop that we have up here. So it says melanated metal hair. Boom. So this is this one here. I do love me a crop, honestly. I really do love me a crop. So let's get on to the next one. So we're into this one now, it's like barbed wires, electric lines, I don't know, it just looks awesome, so this is this one. A lot of this stuff as well comes in t-shirts, so don't worry if you're not a crop top person, there are t-shirts. I'm pretty sure there's leggings versions of this as well, so oh god, that's a flash here, god I don't want YouTube to shut me down. Alright, um, yeah, so that's this one. We get into the next one. So here we are with the next crop here. Ooh, tucked under my bra. So this one says Afro Goth. Um, yeah. So this is this one. And let me show you the final one, which is actually a t shirt. So this is the last one here which says anti-social black girl club which I am literally a member of and have been since birth. So let me show you the back, it's got some print on the back, let me get these braids out for you. So yeah, that is all of them. Like I absolutely love them. They're such great quality. And um, the thing that I love about the most is it is black owned. And for me personally, as a black alternative person, when you can relate to the person who's selling the product, it makes it so much easier. And like you just feel like they totally understand who you are as a person. Because there's not like anywhere that does clothes that like say black metal chip on it, do you know what I mean? And it's like, 
it really harnesses who you are as a person and that's what I love about this brand but you know there's always that back of your mind goth is white but when you've got a black owned company it's someone who's literally you selling someone like you clothes and it's just like rock on <laughs> please ignore the fact that my nails are like completely falling off here I'm trash <laughs> I'm so bad when it comes to nails but yeah look at the nice ones that are actually still here this is what they should look like but it doesn't I'll just put myself in the eye these rings by the way from Rogue and Wolf one of the new models so stay tuned for some of the stuff that I'm going to be posting from them it's so cool when you know big brands notice you as well as a black alternative dog because like I have reiterated thousands of times it, it's being alternative it's just mainly white and considering a lot of the stuff about being alternative isn't or wasn't originally considered white it's it's just one of those things I suppose you know but yeah it is what it is but we're still here we're still out here we're still doing our thing and we're still living unapologetically black and alternative and that's how it will remain check out Rogue and Wolf also check out some of the stuff that I modeled on Killstar I'm on Killstar now as well Ooh, getting there oh god I forgot to sneeze <coughs> whoa okay okay we're back um, also, this little collar here from Mary Jane Lingerie. Let's check them out. I'll put a link to everyone below. But this is mainly about Gothic Lamb. I don't want to take you away from that, but I just have to mention the stuff that I got on today. These braids are on its way out. Can I tell you? Oh my god. Oh my god. Black girls listen up to this, and black men, if you want to do the same thing, listen up, listen up to this. My hair is a mess right now, as you can see, it's growing right out. Now let me tell you why it is growing right out of here. I started about 10, 12 days ago, doing a rice water challenge. If you have not heard about it, if you have not tried it, do it, do it. It's literally amazing. I'm going to put a link to a video down there where I got like all the ingredients to do it and you just spray your hair with it every day you can wash your hair spray your hair I would want to do it but I've been spraying my hair every day with it and oh my god my hair is just growing like mad it's just I feel like I really already need to do these braids because they are they are growing out rice water challenge trust me do it do it do it to my little ethnic babies do it and yeah check out Gothic Lamb link will be below they have Instagram they have Facebook like get on there check out everything they are awesome okay i wouldn't lie to you they're awesome mate 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 wait where's the camera mate anyway <laughs> that was way too close anyway so let me go because i'm chatting crap as per usual yeah hopefully my next youtube video won't be i'm not even gonna lie i don't know where my next youtube video is so I will see you when I see you. Bye guys. I can't even remember how I did my exit. Oh. Bye. <laughs>